hello beautiful people welcome back to the channel Igbe here i hope everyone is doing well i hope you had a great weekend we're back with new remote job leads a brand new week and we're going to be focusing this video on united health or optum because they do have some openings right now that i want to take you guys through i also want to spend some time on their career page to provide some insight on how you can navigate your way around and get additional information about all the roles as well we still have the goal of hitting 10,000 subscribers by the end of the year really really excited guys so please continue to share with your friends and families especially those that are actively searching for new opportunities so let's dive right into today's video we're going to be starting off by spending some time on the career page for united health united health currently has multiple openings i will make sure to include this uh, link in the description of this video so i can go straight into this page so once you get here there are multiple ways you can look for opportunities either you you search by keywords if i do like data for example it's going to give me all the options right now that are available for data so there are no data entry roles but they do have some data analyst roles so those are kind of ways to navigate through the, the page also you want to make sure you click remote jobs with united health or optum there are different options available to you so you can either work in the corporate office or you can work United Healthcare, Optum, Corporate, and so forth. In addition to that, because they are also located in other parts of the world, you can also focus on this. For example, this is for Portuguese. As you can see on here, it's already told me, do I want to translate that? And it's going to do the translation uh, for me. So there are quite some roles available. You just need to navigate your way uh, through the different options. You can see on here right now, they do have an associate enrollment and eligibility representative role open. That is an opportunity to consider. They do have appeals and grievances, medical director, plastic surgeon, virtual role open. Again, that is also an opportunity. There are quite some roles open right now that you should be taking advantage of. So please feel free to explore these opportunities. So the ones I'm going to be focusing on in this video are with United Health Group. This opportunity is uh, titled Associate Enrollment and Eligibility Representative. You will have the flexibility to telecommute from anywhere within the U.S. as you take on some uh, tough ta challenges. Oftentimes when you get these opportunities, you get the free equipment to work from home. So they provide you all the equipment you need, the computer and so forth to be able to work from home also these opportunities in some cases that require training you do get paid for those training hours so this is a, a very practical example of that so this particular role as this titled associate enrollment and eligibility representative national remote this opportunity is within united healthcare what are some of the required qualifications for this role? They're looking for high school diploma or higher, one year of experience helping customers resolve matters. They talk about experience with computer, Windows, applications, and so forth. Experience with Microsoft Office, Excel, Word, etc. The ability to work full-time on any eight-hour shift, Monday through Friday, between the hours of 7 a.m. and 5 p.m. Central Standard Time. It's talking about being able to navigate your way through a computer, talking about being kind, being well-mannered in addressing people's emotional needs, someone who is thoughtful, is empathetic, talks about working effectively um, and always promotes what positivity, working in a team environment. So these are kind of personality traits. So things that really can help people understand kind of what the environment is like and what the expectations are like. There will be five weeks paid training and the salary uh, range for California, uh, Rhode Island and so forth is minimum and up to $27.31 maximum. The next opportunity is with optum as you can see here there is the difference right so you see it says optum customer service representative national remote very similar to the first rule we just went over with this opportunity training also will be provided it is going to be conducted virtually from your home this one is seven weeks of paid training the hours are 9 30 to 6 p.m 
Monday through Friday. This is full time, 40 hours per week, Sunday through Saturday. Employees are required to be flexible to work any of our eight hour shift schedules during our normal business hours of 7 a.m. to 9 p.m. local time. So with this opportunity, you're going to be responding to incoming calls. This is a telephonic opportunity. You're going to be making outbound calls to customers as well, based on the different issues they have. What are the requirements for this role? High school diploma or equivalent? And then familiarity with computer. They do have preference, which is one plus years of experience. But if you do not have any experience, you are still eligible to apply and potentially uh, get this role but they do prefer people that have one plus years of experience. If you have it, make sure you call it out on your resume. The salary is very similar. Again, 16 minimum and $27.31 maximum. The next opportunity is also with Optum and it's titled Billing Representative National Remote. This role is a fully remote opportunity and it is Monday through Friday. So there are no weekends opportunity for this one. And the business hours is 7 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. You're going to be reconciling payments from different banks. You are going to uh, be providing exceptional customer service to um, internal and external customers. You are going to be helping to identify any type of issue trends so that it can be escalated and resolved in a timely manner. They are looking for high school diploma or GED, two plus years experience working in Microsoft Office, especially Excel, Outlook, Word, experience working with medical cash applications, ability to read and interpret explanation of benefits, which is EOB. They do have preferred qualifications as well, such as specialty pharmacy experience, knowledge of NDC, ICD-10, and HIPAA. But if you do not have those, you are still okay to apply for this role and potentially get it. So that is it for this opportunity. And with this one, the salary is slightly higher. The minimum is uh, $16 and the maximum is $31.44 per hour. So we're going to move on to the next role, which is with a different organization, Reynolds. Reynolds is looking for a chat specialist. You are going to be working as a chat operator. So chat specialists provide individuals the ability to engage in online conversations. You are going to be handling a variety of customer inquiries via online chats, providing accurate information, supporting customers, previous experience in retail, someone who's able to handle basic internet navigation, computer skills, positive professional demeanor, excellent written and verbal communications, those are the qualifications for this role. It does talk about requirements as well. Um, must live within the state uh, listed in the posting. Uh, so for this particular role, it is Columbus, Ohio. So you do need to live in Ohio to qualify for this role. Must be able to type at least 35 words per minute. The salary is $13 per hour. So if you live in uh, Columbus, Ohio, definitely check it out. So that is it for this role. The next opportunity is with Blue Cross Blue Shield of Minnesota. So Blue Cross Blue Shield is looking for a third party liability associate. This is a fully remote role, was just recently posted. And with this role, the expectation is to have some knowledge of medical terminology, one years of experience in healthcare, previous customer service or call center experience, third party liability and surrogation experience highly desired. Experience with computer, excellent time management skills, proficient with Microsoft Office products and so forth. So that is it for this uh, particular role. So those are the opportunities, guys. I hope you find these leads helpful. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel if you've not subscribed already. Turn your notification bell on so you get notified real time whenever these opportunities do go up. I want to thank you guys again so much. Till next time, best of luck to you as you apply. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.